Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, and we will continue our playthrough of The Room with chapters 3 and 4. Uh, these two chapters sort of go together, and you'll sort of see why in just a quick moment. So let's continue on. <clears throat> okay, so we have this table stuff to look at. Let's... I should focus on the sides of the box for now. Well, no. There's stuff on top. I want to see it. Fine. Yeah, it sort of forces you down to the sides and the, the bottom of the table before you start the top. So let's carry, f carry on. Carry forth. Carry on. Carry on, my wayward son, and try and find something where we can start this off and get ourselves rolling. Ordinary keyhole. Well, that's boring. Alright, we got a globe there. Ah. So far, nothing's really springing to mind, so let's just take a look with the lens, see if anything sort of pops out at us. So far, nothing. I need something. An irregular, irregularly shaped hole. Yes, yes, we know. It's an irregular hole. Nope, that's not turnable, so we need something to go in there. Really? Oh, there we go. Aha! Finally something to... first. You can go down there. Square hole. Alright, awesome. Well, we got that ready for something. You can look at those, but I have a feeling that they will be needed later. Uh, star shape. Here. Something to go in there. So we are, aha, finally, something. Now we're going July 15th. My research into the null element continues at pace. Given the nature of its origin, I am increasingly convinced that it is somehow tied to my very soul. Its properties are becoming clear. It derives a colossal energy from somewhere. I have fashioned a device through which to channel and focus it, but I am fearful of further experimentation. I lack the understanding to control it. Well, that's too bad, Alfred with some kind of puzzle on top. Well, as long as it's something that we can... Oh, one of these. We know all about this. Nope. Doesn't go there. Doesn't go there. Nope. Maybe I'm wrong then. Turn that 
entire box. Okay, so maybe it doesn't go here. Nope. Maybe. This is something different. Oh, there we go. Oh, look. It's an ordinary key. Maybe it'll go into our ordinary keyhole. So let's find that again. There's our ordinary keyhole. Yep. Please turn. Oh, okay. Another one of these sort of three, four, five, and then back the other way. Dope. All right, let's look at this a little bit more straight on. Five this way, four this way. Then back to <gasps> there we go. Easy peasy. A small square peg. Well, that's good. Uh, it's a frame for a piece of paper with viewing lens. Well, I have a piece of this paper. looks kind of blurry. So if I have the lens, it's one of them moving pictures, like in the Harry Potters. Sigil. So, yep, it's a sigil on, right? All right next piece of the puzzle. So let's get that down. <gasps> oh, look. I wonder. <laughs> Has no R. How am I supposed to say trial or trail? I know it's supposed to say sigil. There. A bright blue crystal emanating a strange light. Well, awesome. Here's another note from Alfred. July 29th. A new discovery has shaken me to my core. To investigate the refractive properties of the null element. I've fashioned lenses from it. To where one is troubling and exhausting in equal measure and I am shown visions that are beyond my comprehension. The visions turn darker and deeper into the earth I go. I have relocated my study to the North Tower. I can no longer visit the wine cellar. I am too drunk. Great, so you fashioned a lens and then you gave it to me and now I'm sort of going crazy, is that it? Is that it, Mr. Alfred? Uh, okay, so we have this. Nope, okay. There is something that, the top maybe? No, nope, that's for another device, so. Uh, on the base, on the base, on the base. On the base, on the base, I knew it. Not like I haven't beaten this before, but. Oh, there's the light. Okay, so. Now that I have a light, it doesn't do anything. Well, awesome. But I do know it will do something shortly. A uh, square hole for something to fit into. Well, great. Now I'm at an impasse again. Can I get this back? Nope, I guess not. So, is there anything, is there anything else? There could be a hidden compartment or something somewhere where just not seeing it. It's 
why you always have to be extra careful when looking through these clues. Something could just be there waiting for you to proceed with next. Uh, nope, there's nothing left to do there. So, hmm. oh, there's something. There's something. There's something, except it's not doing anything. There's a wheel missing here. All right. And those flip up and make a handle. Right, I remember that a little bit. But. Okay, there's nothing here. I can't take the key back. Oh. Oh, I can move that. So maybe there's something. Can I get something in the globe? Please. Does it have something on there? Lens like. Nope. Okay. Okay, and that's just another puzzle which I don't have any clues for, so I'm not gonna carry on on it. So the only thing that is sort of different here is the fact that I got this light going. Uh, can I... No, come on. There we go. Can I... Yeah, I can do that. Alright. That's what it needed. Tiny weighted flywheel. Great! Well, that's our clue for where it goes. I did see that. Would you be quiet? I'm trying to play a game here. Some sort of device for reflecting light. Oh. Yep. And... Hexagonal piece of the map. All right, now we're cooking with gas. So let's do the map piece first. It was a hexagon. Where is our hexagon? Is it that? It's that. Brass winding handle with a square pin. Awesome, all right. There was another square pin somewhere. It was right here chunk but it's blank so says someone not intending on doing the right thing come on all right wants to look that way so we just need to turn this until something almost right there A wooden box. So let's check this wooden box. Nope. And you want to go like that. And you go in somewhere too. Alright, let's go back here because this device needs to go in here somewhere. There. So it'll light up that side of the table. Now you have to go around and find the next piece to go. Come on. And you're basically up. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is. Brass key with multiple flight folding parts. So we got that side. Now the other one. It's a timing-based puzzle, so you gotta be quick. Come on, come 
Come on, come on, come on. Nope. And star shaped piece of the map. To bed, I think. And that should be both of them. Okay, perfect. So that sort of clears off that. Going pretty well so far, so let's go to the bed. Um, is there nothing there? All right, fair enough. <laughs> nothing there. Uh, we had this oddly shaped. Maybe it's not there yet. Okay, so let's concentrate on this and get this brass key thing going. <laughs> no, don't need to spell it out for me, game. May have done one of these or two in the past. Don't need that. I think we're good with this guy now. So, yep. Another small refracting, reflecting device. All right. So back over here. Go and stick that on that side. All right. So, there's our beam of light. Let's... Oh. Maybe not so much. Let's try that. going pretty... Oh. There we are. Yep, I'm done with you now. And up, and up, and... Oh. Purdy. An oddly shaped piece of map, part of South America. Jeez, don't have to spell it out that I need to go to the globe for this. But there you go. And... Okay, so I have this box that seems to want to... It almost seems like it's a part for something, so... Where do I put you? I thought I seen something like that before. Got one more piece of the map to go. Ah, there you are. Sort of like a cross diagonal. Okay. So that was our hint for over here. Doinka, 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 doinka. Square piece of the map. August 9th. The circle were right all along. How can I have been so blind? I have discovered a passage in their scriptus 
No. Naughty? An incantation lacking the energy source to drive it. Well, I have such a source. This night, I summon Astaroth, whom the Babylonians called Ishtar, Prince of Accusers and Inquisitors, and he who can discover all secrets. Once correctly bound, all knowledge of the null element can be mine. I can barely contain myself. Woohoo! There is so much to prepare. Almost got all the notes too, so yay! Alright, so we are getting there. Square piece, chunk, that's the last piece of that. Now what will you do? Pull the emergency brake on this table! Missile silo in here. And that concludes chapter three. Pleasing progress, but do you really have. But do you really think you have proven yourself yet? Um, no. <laughs> That's why we're continuing on. Uh, so we'll just jump right into chapter four which will take us to the top of the table. Right. I missed something down here. Let me look, let me look. No. <laughs> Bottom of the table is done. Now we're at the top. So now we have to determine where we're going next. Again, our phone accelerometer will solve this puzzle. We'll get our little brass winding handle, and we'll finish off our notes. August 15th. Something is wrong. I followed the incantation to the very letter. Astaroth did not appear. There was no answers to be had. More questions. So confused. The visions have increased. They gather to me, and I cannot stay in one place for long. I try to monitor, but the lens hurts my eyes. I have mixed. I have, I have mixed. I have mixed a solution to, for the pain. Um, for those that follow and find this journal, I lack the power to describe this. There is no concept within the human sphere with which to explain it. The house is so much larger now. There are rooms everywhere. Dun dun dun. So that is the last note for Alfred Smith. Quite a dapper fellow though, so it's a shame to see him go and get all loony. All right. So, where is next? Large circular indentation. But nothing to be had until we get something else. Yes, 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 I know. This almost seems like that can be done, but nope, doesn't want to. So we'll let this go here. Not a button. Okay. Well, let's look at the handle. It's a square peg, so I just need to find a place to put it in, I guess. Oh. Small socket. I don't think. No. Yep, that's it. There's turning, trying to turn it by hand. Okay. So, let that go. It's 
the sword. It's the sword of Damocles. Uh oh. Creepy. That perhaps? Oh, it's the sword of Damocles. An ornate an ornate ancient dagger. To which I stabbed myself with the ha No, not quite. Um center of the table? Yep, you look very much like a sword holding thing. Makes me think how all this stuff can fit in here, but <gasps> jewels. Nope. Okay. So, yep. Again, like the last puzzle, we need a clue for that. And it would not be. No, it's not a four by four. It's a three by four. So, let's. Well, okay. <laughs> Since you want to just lay it right out there for me. Go from the top corner and go down. So, bunk, 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 bunk. Thank you. I guess I'll press this again. It's telling me I have to. We're gonna look in here again. Oh my goodness, it is so creepy. I know you want to. Where's. Oh, I get another combination there, so maybe I have to do that first. Okay, big Y, because you know what, I ask myself the same thing, why, 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 all right, yes, now everything's standing still, there's our null element sigil again, a large gold amulet, well, and that looks vaguely familiar to... This guy. Trunk. What is next, table? What is next? You will not defeat me! I will break you! Oh my goodness. Aha. Okay, so. I think process here is that you have to line up each of those. Uh -huh. No, it still needs something else. Okay, so... to look at the tabletop as well. Come on. Oh, almost. Hmm. Okay, yep, I see. It's given us more clues, so one, two, one, and then, because we're going to be pressing that numpad one more time. So, that one we just need. Third level, come on, perk. Looks good, looks good. Is it one, two, one, two? Yep. This looks very null 
like. The energy source harnessing the null element. One more time. Again, but I also have to look. look. There we go. something with this. Just have to find the right side for it, I think. I think. Oh, I just had to go in there. All right, I'm a little bit of a dummy. do we do? I knew this would have to be... Come on. It's not that hard. Do I put the null element onto there? Flustered, I hope, as there will be, as there will surely be sterner tests to come. Oh, you have no idea. Uh, you have taken the first step on a longer journey. I see no benefit in hiding the truth from your predicament. There is no way back for any of us. For now, you are as trapped as I. Press forward with heart, my friend. There are many rooms ahead. So that will conclude this episode of my playthrough of The Room. There's still the epilogue to go through, so we'll make one more episode after this, I'm sure. Um, but if you are enjoying the game, let me know. Um, let me know if you want to see uh, any of the other The Room series on my channel. Because uh, they, like I said, they've been a blast to play and replay every time I pick them up again. Um, but if you do like the video, uh, hit the like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel for more as I play other mobile games. Um, some of which that you might like. This has been Shin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.